You know what? Fuck it. <laughs> I, w I want to know the uh, the stats for the uh, the Abra. Abra. And Pokemon Blue. Stats. Oh, it is a fast boy. Alright. Oh, PokemonDatabase.net. Okay, that seems good. Da -da -da. Base stats. So I guess that's like what, level 1? Oh no, this... Okay, this. I think this is showing me like a... Yeah. Oh my god, there's this many Pokemon games? Fuck. No, this is too much. It's fast. Some moves have negative priority. May have to check. I will check for Sing now. Okay. Um... Are we gonna go the, the Pikachu route and uh, do the Thundershot? Because if Throg is saying that um, it's worked for him, it just seems the most obvious. Because you're right, like, um, there is a chance that it will try to do something, but it will say, Oh, it's paralyzed, can't do shit. Hmm. Okay, good. Oh, that was great. Get slapped. Oh, that's gonna require two. Okay, growth hormone. The Sylvester Stallone special. Oh, good. Two growths, good. That's the way I've always done it. Thunder Wave, then throw Pokeballs. Thunder Wave is 100% hit. Okay, good. Um, I'm doing it. Let's just hope that when, when that Thunder Wave hit, though, when that Thunder Wave hit, though, it doesn't teleport. There's always the chance that it will. And I think my electric rat would get fucked by Pidgey if it does a, a dirty quick attack. We don't want that. Yeah. Bite into Pulse's chicken. Delicious. Okay. Okay. I mean, it's good. It won't help me to get the Abra, but it's always good to get level. He will still run around a lot, but you got a good chance. <sighs> Boom. God damn it. Quick attack. Come on, Abra. Come on. I know you want to be part of the crew. Sing has normal priority. Hmm. But the thing is, like, my, um... My thick-ass Jigglypuff, it, it's... It's gonna get outsped by it. And I, I don't really have the patience to grind out the levels needed to outspeed an Abra. I'm not even sure, like, a, a Jiggly can outspeed an Abra. So... That's not bad. Get some levels on the rat, that'd be good. Oh, th three growth. That was a mistake. This would be a lot of XP. Yeah, nice. Shall save here. Saving takes five seconds. Great. Come on, Abra. Come on. Come on home, Abra. We're waiting. We're waiting. Quick attacks. Probably should have done the Thunder Wave because that did more damage last time, I think. Whatever. It's all about the Abra. D 
dirty metapod. Alright. So if I get one more level, I can one hit this at level 8. Good. Good to know. Abra? Abra? Damn it. I don't think Thundershock did so well, and I think Quick Attack's like meh. That's gonna hurt. Let's just get in you. It's always good to put levels on the other uh, the starter. Get bitten. Ekans does a good job on Abra 2, using Rap if you have one, but this is blue right now. Yep. Alright. Moment of truth. Uh, thunder... Wave. Stay put! Stay put! <laughs> um... Okay, now, do I... Attack it, or go straight for the Pokeball. Yeah, yeah. Get in my belly! Fuck yeah. Nice. Alright, so... I think we're gonna call this one Throg. Why not? Throg came up with the winning strap. I know that Waitar, um, that, uh, the Sing strap for the Jiggly was a good strap. I have used it personally. It's just that in this particular instance, this fucker was too fast. Using its ability to read minds, it will identify impending danger and teleport to safety. Yes, it will. Alright. You could be the next cool one, Waitar. I will not forget about you. Throw TV. Alright. Nice. I, I never doubted you, Throg. It's just, after it didn't happen the first time, I got frustrated. I apologize. Huzzah! Indeed. We caught a fucking Abra. Do, 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 do. Heal up, and then I think we're gonna swap out one of our existing six. Are we gonna immediately put the Abra into the uh, into the mix though? Because it has no attacks and takes ages to um. Uh... Oh, I agree, Throg. Uh, um, Alakazam has always been my favorite Pokemon in in uh, Pokemon Blue. Um, there are the mean the mean Pokemon though. For example, Psyduck. But Psyduck in the game is actually shit. Psyduck was only ever good in the animation. Like, let's not get it twisted. Uh, no, I don't want to. No. So, okay, deposit. Um, Skinflute's just getting fucked up, so. I'll put my Skinflute in the box. So, oh wait, 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 We do want to have a look at the stats. 21, no fucking, okay. That's the reason. Best Pokemon in the game. You must level it to level 16. Maybe wait until you get, yep. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. Definitely wet up. That's, that's the move. Like, I, I want, I want more Abra in my life, but I need to grind him out, don't I? Yeah. It's fine. So, who else can we put in here, then? Uh, um, as you can see, I've got some great, great Pokemon in here. Skinflute is uh, Sandshrew. A Geodude. Dickhead. Who's Dickhead? Who's this Dickhead? Kakuna. Kakuna. Yeah, Kakuna really is a Dickhead. Um, Fleshlight. Oh, huh. <laughs> Oh, well, as per our discussion before. <laughs> yes. 
Uh, Sandshrew are fantastic as well, one of the best ground types in the game. Hmm. You are correct. It's just, it will take time to level him up. And he's weak to so much at the moment. Uh, fish and chips is, uh, well... Oh wait, no, I didn't want fish and chips. I mean, I, I would like some fish and chips right now, but... Fish and chips is our uh, magic card. Now, we're not leveling that bad boy to 20 just yet. Uh, Delta Strain Zubat. Golden Sun is a Paras. Beard Master is a what? Ooh, it's a Clefairy? Yes. Clefairy is actually, like, super shit from, from memory. I think it only has, like, one evolution. And, like, <laughs> we don't fuck with, like, one evolution Pokemon right here. Zubat is, like, Delta Strain tier. Yeah. Let's be honest. Um, that Fleshlight, though. I'm just saying. Um, I think you're right, though. I think I might have to get, um... I think Geodude is decent, but, like, he gets to its second evolution, and then the third evolution you need to trade to get to Golem, right? And I don't type that yet. I guess we're going with Sashru. The thing is, these are just our Pokemon for right now. Now that we've got the Abra, we can actually move on a little bit and get into um, some different areas to get some different Pokemon. So I think that's exactly what we're going to do. Clefairy are actually quite good in game as they can learn any move. Interesting. Give them Psychic, Thundershock, and Sir. That sounds really dirty, actually. If it's got good stats, then that'll probably be interesting. But would I want a Clefairy in my final six? That's a hard sell. I think, like, um, a Dragonite would be good. Big Chongus. What's a 45? I hate how you can't, like, press up to cycle back down to the other side. To the bottom, I mean. Or what is this one? Okay. I mean, it's good that I have it. Uh, that's right, Clefairy does need a Moonstone. I've got two. Mint Shield, yeah. The thing is, like, I don't really want to bother leveling up Pokemon that are just... They're not going to be around for long. Now, I think this particular area here is part of the setup for, um... Getting the Mew. But, um, I'm not going to do it, so... We'll just go through it as normal. Greasy Chicken. Or Pulse. Uh, you shall get zapped. And it's going to peck me now, isn't it? Oh, just a sand attack? Uh, alright. Uh, quick attack. Finger licking good. Alright. Hopefully we can get a new Pokemon in here. Instead of the rubbish. Actually, is this all part of the same area? As in, is it just like, um... Uh, Metapod, Bellsprout, Abra... And, uh, the other one. Because if it is, I'll just move on a bit further. Yeah, okay. I shall go... beat up these trainers. Speaking of beating up the trainers, who should go up front? I obviously want my, uh... my Uzudu, my electric rat, to get levels. But... There are other more deserving. Okay, I think... Okay, Fero, uh, Pidgey, uh, Jigglypuff. Do I want Jigglypuff up at the front? I think maybe the Sand Shrew, actually. It's severely underleveled. Alright, let's, let's just deal with these guys. Bonesaw is ready! 